Yes, it's Monday. I got my X-Men shirt on because I'm feeling like a superhero today. This is uh, Jay Nubbins, a.k.a. the Komodo Dragon. One thing that came up, we are human. We are not perfect. So I know I hold myself in a high regard to try to be perfect, but I'm not perfect by any stretch of the imagination. All we can do is just keep improving our game and working harder. So someone told me that they want to see more cooking from the Jay, the old Jay Nubster. So there we go. So what do I got? I'm making a, I'm making a Thai omelet. Probably done this, maybe done a little video about this. But so I got shrimp, I got garlic, I got some mushrooms, and I got some onions. Okay. So here's the deal. Got right, there. So I'm going to cook this quick, then I'm going to take it out. Then I'm going to put eggs down for the omelet, deep fry the omelet, and then when it gets a little more fried, I'm going to add back this stuff because you do not want to overcook your shrimp, okay? That's key, right? So that's what I'm doing. And also, I got these pickled radishes, and I'll show you, okay. So this is um, chashu with some rice and ginger. So I'm gonna put that in the old air fryer. Right, and I'll have my omelet, and I got that. Oh, get some of the spinach going on in here. Go, get a little bunch of the spinach. Get a more a little more spinach into my life. There we go. Aha. All right. What I'm also gonna do is a little bit of the soy while it's cooking, so it kind of muddles together, right? And with the omelet, what I do is put a little bit of um, flour. You can also use gluten, gluten-free flour to make it like the omelet get a little more crispy. And then I'm going to use this, uh, the old secret weapon. Where is it? It's hiding. I'll find it. Ah, here we go. Yeah. The old Vietnamese fish sauce, put a little of that into this, uh, omelet. It just gives a whole depth of flavor that smells horrible, but I'm telling you, it's not, it's good. Um, trust me, trust the Nubster. And if you don't like it, you don't have to have it, but it really does have uh, like the extra flavor that you that you want, that you're going for, all right? So I'm excited. Be excited about your meals. Be excited what you're cooking because you could do crappy stuff that's processed or you could make some like good stuff. And if you make the good stuff without the processing, extra all the other stuff, you will lose weight. I will guarantee it, okay? And you'll feel, you'll feel healthier too. So I'm going to cook this down a little bit and then we'll come back.